So overall, I was going to see what was uh, kind of different tonight. What were they doing well? Maybe it was frustrating you guys for most of the game. Would you say? Well, I, I thought, and I didn't think we had the edge we needed to have in the first period. I thought we were a little bit uh, watching and reactionary instead of uh, being assertive and going after the game. Uh, yeah. They took advantage of it, and I, I thought that the first period kind of cost us a game. And then obviously, you know, you're not going to put that team on a par play five on three twice. Yeah. You know, um, but we were doing a good job killing five on four, and you know they got extended minutes of time on a, on a five on three, and mm -hmm. difference in the game. How big was it early in the game too? You guys had the struggles with the power play, where you know the, the first goal came right after a power play ended, and the second goal was a kind of a turnover you made. I mean, how much of a factor was that? What were you guys maybe doing wrong at that stage that you hadn't been doing lately? Well, I'll be honest with you. I thought our first power play we moved around really well. Yeah. I thought we had really good. We had a pop up play. We had two good scoring yeah. chances on the first one. I mean, it was at the end of the power play that we uh, uh, made a mistake exiting the yeah. zone. We didn't recognize, and we've done that on a, on a couple of back to back games. We yeah. don't recognize that. Okay, we're back to five on five play here, yeah. and uh, and uh, you know we should have just we should have gone into a little. Bit roll out with their two guys back and mm -hmm. and been uh, been cognizant of the fact that it was it was now five on five, um, but you know I, I the second power play we didn't do very well but I, you know I thought tonight I thought our power play actually moved the puck pretty well mm -hmm. I thought uh, you know like I said it's a situation where we had a couple turnovers and two five on three goals and it adds up yeah. to a loss pretty quick. One thing I saw was you know it seems like you guys have improved possession improved you know moving the puck and it just needs to find a way to score. What's it going to take? Well, I just think obviously, you know, it's not, it just get confidence, right? You know, we obviously, uh, I thought we had opportunities tonight, but um, I thought from the second period on, I thought our puck possession was good. I thought we're, we have grown as a team. Um, you know, I thought I thought if Union did something well tonight, uh, I thought they they blocked shots. I thought they had a couple opportunities and uh, they had, our shots didn't get through. They they collapsed down low and then they get the, um, they got in shot lanes on us tonight, but. Uh, you know, like I said, yeah, we have to be more assertive and get after the game in the first period. To uh, and then maybe those turnovers aren't there. And um, you know, obviously going into the game, I said that uh, on the radio. You know, if you're going to go in a game and give uh, and. We're going to have some key turnovers mm -hmm. and uh, against a team that can transition and don't need many opportunities to score. And we're going to put them on a five-on-three power play twice a night for extended amounts of time. That's not a that's not a great recipe for success against a team like that. Looking at tomorrow night's game too, did you like the way you guys ended this game? You had a good third period. You played, you know, you got on the board. I mean, do you feel like you built some maybe momentum or confidence that you can take into tomorrow night's game? How you yeah, well, I don't, I don't think I don't think we lack confidence. Yeah. I don't think. Well, I mean, it's, yeah, but I mean, I, like I. I it, it's not that. I mean, we have to play Clarkson hockey, and for a period of hockey, 20 minutes, that's not how we have to play to win a game. I mean, mm -hmm. we, I thought we were just a little bit tentative for whatever reason, not prepared to be physical. Mm -hmm. um, you know, like I, I told the guys, I mean, we have a team that came out and out hit us in the first period in our barn. You know, yeah. that's 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 not going to win us a whole lot of hockey games, and that's not that's not how we want to play. I thought we regrouped and competed at a high level, but you know, end all, we're we're not into moral victories. Yeah. You know, we game tonight, we lost the hockey game, and we got to we got to bank it tomorrow and get back here, and we got to get yeah. two points at home on our it's the end of our uh, long home stand, and we want to win it on uh, end it on a good note. I think it was kind of unfortunate that Tansy left on the in the mark that he was. He was having a fantastic game before then. Yeah, you know, I, I I was surprised it was called a disqualification at the game, uh, but uh, you know it's a judgment call. I thought it was blindside is what what the explanation was. Uh, he's impacted games physically. Uh, I do know that Kevin plays a, a hard physical game, but I do know he's disciplined and uh, he's not a dirty player. So um, you know it's unfortunate that uh, they felt it was a blindside hit and high. Uh, so it it was a judgment call and and um, it's it is what it is.